So the first thing to realise is this is the screen you get when you first download your CD and you can see that it's already got all these colours along the bottom. So just to prove how clever it all is, there's half a heart. Copy, paste, go to flip and now I can join that heart to that heart and I've got heart. So you've got the facility to design freehand like this. I can choose a back stitch and let's say I want to choose a different colour back stitch. I'm going to choose black lines for the moment and I can draw around my design. This time we're going to have a look at another way of starting using ideas for cards and samplers. So for instance a birthday card. This is just so that it's still there when you get it next, when you want to use it next time. So there you are, you've got a pair of interesting balloons and notice that some of the colours have appeared in your palette. So let's go up here, clear unused colours. Now these are the colours that are in existence in our design and of course these can be changed at any time by going back to your palette. So I'm going to import a picture and then I'm going to look for a picture I'd like to use. Let's see what we've got here. Oh, this is a nice one. This is the American Museum at Bath. Now, at this point, this is already a cross stitch. Instantly, it has been created as a cross stitch. And I'm going to show you what that looks like. And there it is. Now, if I get a long way away for you, so you can see it, that is a cross stitch. Already it is but it's very detailed. 